The next big news here is the reported signing of Dante DiVincenzo. Uh, he has been very effective off the bench, comes over from the Warriors. Wally, what will he add to this team once this becomes official? I think it's a great addition to this team. We all know Tom Thibodeau loves to run pick and roll with his playmakers and his guards. You're adding another guy that has those point guard skills. Yeah, and it just goes to show the Knicks' mindset is Jalen Brunson is the cornerstone of this franchise, and they are surrounding him with the pieces that's going to maximize him as a player, and also he's going to maximize his teammates as a player. His, his transformation of this team and this organization since he's gotten here has been outstanding. The piece coming, Josh Hart, outstanding, and I think the DiVincenzo piece is going to be almost just as good and very effective. I want to compliment the Knicks' front office. Right? I understand that when, when you're talking about Donovan Mitchell and you're talking about they could have got him in this, well, they didn't want to give up everything. They decided to stick with the plan that they've had for the last couple of years, and it's working. Yes, they got Brunson, and he is looking like a steal. 20-point a game, to like score. He can man your offense. He can help control your defense. He's a great late-game free-throw shooter. So he's helping you guys do all the things, and he's taking the ball out of Julius Randle's hand a little bit. So when I look at what the Knicks are doing, I'm giving you guys a compliment. You guys are following the, the template that you said you were going to follow. You're not going to worry about crazy free agents. You're going to build block by block. Grimes gets inside and gets the bucket to go. Grimes carries a three. Grimes just hit the biggest shot of the night. You want to advance the cause. You got to the second round. You have another winning season. What you're trying to do now is stack them, is continue to put them together. They have a group that they believe can do that. They have a group that they saw in the second half of the season and also in the first round of the playoffs. And so, look, Miami, who had a great run, and the Knicks were one basket away from forcing a Game 7. They were one play away from getting to a Game 7 in their building against that team. So that's how close they feel they were. to the second round for what would be just the second time in the last 22 years.